Hey everybody, it's Mark T here. I'm here doing my third try at the Neon Genesis second movie. Because, I don't know, YouTube was down yesterday or some BS. Anyway, so time for the review. So what I thought of the series of the movie was fantastic. You know, it was one of the best anime movies I've seen in theory, which is in like, which is a pretty big stretch, just because like, I've only seen one other anime movie in the theaters. You know, but it was fantastic, you know, absolutely fantastic. Unfortunately, like, I was planning on seeing the first movie, like, um, I don't know, like, buying it or downloading it and then watching it before I saw the, first, the second one, but, I don't know, it doesn't really bother me that much. I, I still plan on seeing the first one, but, um, I'm talking about the second one today. So, it was fantastic, you know. It was really good. They had, like, like, one of the things that surprised me, in fact, was the, uh, the fact that it was in it was in Japanese. I mean, I'm not I'm not saying like that that should be a big surprise. It's just like in the movie trailer that they had on the Cineplex website, it was in English. So then I was like, okay, sure. So then it should probably be in English at the theaters. But then it was all in Japanese. I don't know. It didn't really make much of a difference to me because they at least had subtitles. So of course I was able to read everything since I was so used to watching anime in Japanese. Um, but yeah, it was really good. You know, they had really good um, voice actors and stuff. And the animation was really good too. Um, one of my favorite parts of the movie is definitely the, uh, the gay scene that I will not get into, but it's, it's hilarious. Um, anyways, and then uh, the animation was really well too. Basically, like these second movies for people that didn't know, these movies are made up of um, just um, parts of the series. Like, like let's say the first movie is maybe like the first half of the series or something. And the second movie is like the second half, and then there's just like a whole bunch of other parts. Because I know there's going to be other movies based on the series, but um, from what I've seen, yeah, it's, it's really good. And this movie is particularly interesting because it actually seemed like the ending of the series, which my friend says it is, but I'm not necessarily sure. But uh, yeah, it's a really good movie, really good animation, and uh, had a lot of action, you know, because I, I didn't know what to expect because. The main things I knew, like, I, I watched the first half of the series, um, a couple of years ago, but I never ended up getting around to finishing the whole series itself, and, uh, from when I saw it, I just, I thought, yeah, a really good, a really good robot anime series, you know, kind of like, kind of like Gun Wing, or not Gun Wing, kind of like, um, Gun of Seed with, you know, the whole protagonist not wanting to actually fight, in that sense, but realizing he has to fight to help protect the friends and people that he cares about in this world. So yeah, it's really, really good movie, great animation, great jokes, and uh, yeah, so my score is 10 out of 10. If you haven't seen it already, go check online, check on YouTube, and you'll see it. That's all for now. See you later.